Hi brothers and sisters, two videos in one day. You're going to see this video before the other one I did this morning. The one I did this morning is um, kind of testimony. So, but I just want to share with you something God just did. Amazing. So I got my prayer closet, was talking to the Lord, and uh, my husband came in, spent some time with him, and I decided, okay. I have some time. I'm going to go on a prayer walk. I have 19 acres here. It's all woods. You've seen it if you've seen some of my other videos. I decided to go on a prayer walk. As I'm walking along my fence to turn the corner, the Lord says, I'm going to show you some things on the prayer walk today. I'm going to show you some of my beauty. I was like, okay. The last time I walked out here, was um, before any of the green. We had a couple days back in, I think, March or something, March or April. That was nice. So there was, like, no leaves on the trees, no anything. And I went walking, so that was the last time. I'm like, okay, I'm walking and talking to the Lord just about here and there and talk about I can't wait to get to heaven. And, you know, I'm not a fan of bugs. Oh, I'm not a fan of bugs. I don't like I don't like buzzing around me. I don't like things landing on me. I love the outdoors. I love nature. I just, I'm just very sensitive to my skin. Like things touch me, it, it creeps me out. <laughs> my husband just laughs at me. He's like, you couldn't do bees. No, that's not my thing. But I'm walking as I got... We own this whole parcel goes back and then we own on the side of our house. There's eight acres and we own that. And it wasn't until I got, I, I went around, got a trail and come along here on the side of my house here. And then I seen a big, huge doe that popped up and then she took off just a little ways and then she completely stopped. So I don't know what that was about. I probably spooked her. Um, but then something got my attention, I don't know what it was, but I happened to look down and there's this baby groundhog and I knew that's what the Lord was talking about. I knew he said, I'm going to show you some of my true beauty. And I knew that's what he was talking about. He, see, the Lord knows me. I'm a sucker for animals. When it comes to animals, especially like wildlife, if something's hurt or for one, I want to keep everything as a pet and I know that I can't do that. So I'm always trying to help it, help things, and if something's harmed, I'll bring it in, you know, fix it up, and then release it, or try. Um, but this baby groundhog was down there on the ground, and um, my husband has food plots all over the place for deer and stuff, but it's in these food plots, and um, it, it looks like it's just sitting there, and its hands are, like, you know, together, and I see, I see kind of, like, a few... Uh, flies on it and stuff and I'm like shooting them away and I'm like is this thing alive so I like touch the top of its head and it's moving a little bit and I like rub his head and then he lays down and I'm like rubbing his back and I realize oh that's a little baby you know like he was like this big yeah so he was probably about six seven inches long hair all over you know just like a like a miniature groundhog and uh, just cute as a button. So I pet it and I'm thinking, we have a string that normally runs alongside of our house and it's been dry. So wildlife can't get the water unless they go down to our big lake, which is way in the back and a baby ain't making it. So I'm like, I'll just bring the baby up to my house, get it some water and take it back. So I'm like walking with this baby. I had my hoodie coat on and oh, cute as a button, super cute. And um, Brielle's getting into stuff. And so uh, I bring it up here to get a drink and I realize it wasn't drinking. And then I realize its ears are kind of sealed. There's something in the ears. And I'm like, this thing is probably on milk. I think his ears aren't open yet. I'm like, okay. So I run the baby back out and went and put it back where I found it. If it's still on milk, the mom will come back and get it. And she probably just had it be there because it's safe. Um, the food plots are pretty high. It's like, looks like they look like a bunch of four leaf clovers, but I, I don't know, it's like a brassicas or something. I don't know. I don't know what all he put out there. But it was amazing. The Lord said, I'm gonna show you some of my 
beauty. And I see that baby. He knows my heart. That was, he's so good. So this kind of can go along with a little testimony of like what you're going to see when the other video uploads. But I don't want this to be long. I want you guys to get this right away. So I'm going to go ahead and cut this here right now. I hope you all have a good day. And my next video should be out probably in the next couple hours. takes forever. So, all right. Bye.